I was just, I ended up getting crazy, like psychotically addicted to it. You know, I was like, so I'd have to be there. And it's like a two hour drive, but I would be there. And that's where I still have that. You know what I mean? I got to get to the farm like early, you know, I want, I want farmership. I wanted to ask you, man, is like the way you have everything set up and the way you operate and move, like, like you really, you really play long game in all your moves, all your thinking and all your stuff, but you got the energy of like someone that just started, Mm -hmm. which is like, that's super rare. Where do you think like that comes from? Like I, I literally, I literally love it every day. Like I'm so happy with you guys there at the farm today. You know what I mean? Just looking through everything, like, and and getting some assurance too, like from everybody else is dope. Like I love the plant, and I, I always put it first. Dude, you can tell, man, a hundred percent. Something can tell. really special you got going on. Thanks, you know, man. because it's. I I would say that like to anyone looking at any great person in any type of industry, it's uh, that's how it feels. Like. They've been doing it so long, but it feels like they just started. For sure. The excitement. It's no, like, man, 18 years real. is a long time yeah. to keep high excite, excitement, high energy, As high an discipline. Like people, I mean, you can tell it wakes me up early. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? And I get to it right away and I stay on it. And I'm always on it. I mean, you got to stay on it. It's, it's, to this point, what I have, I have a lot of plants to deal with too. You know what I mean? And we do it. I got five guys at the farm. I just hired my first guy at the indoor facility, 180 lights, no employees. You know what I mean? Now I got one guy who's helping. It's mainly just to watch stuff, you know, to make sure something doesn't break when I'm at the farm. That's the point of it really. But, you know, it helps a lot. Just to give people an example, like how many different strains do you think you run right now? Just strains, including (sighs) females. So I have over 260 strains at the greenhouse right now in that veg house that you guys saw over 260 strains so I, i've been hoarding strains for like 15 years you know i would tuck them i keep the cut i bring bring the redo the cut just saving one you know what I mean? i've lost a lot in the meantime of course through all the bullshit but i still have genetics from that long ago 